there are rich pickings to be had when it comes to these delicacies. Snails or escargot are a favorite dish in French cuisine, but in South Africa they're still new on the menu. One enterprising couple is hoping to change that by cultivating and harvesting the garden gastropods. We thought four years ago, um, could we make a living growing snails? It's been an uh, uphill climb. The demand is there. Being a pilot plant, we don't have the continuity. And that is why we're looking at investors to make it bigger so that we can feed the, the market. The snails are bred either outdoors in a controlled enclosure or indoors for year-round production. They're ready for the market in just seven months. We can sell around about 200 snails a month at the moment. We are being very cautious because we don't want to kill the herd. Low in fat and high in protein, snails are a healthy snack. But they're also expensive, especially if they're imported. The fluctuation in currency means that the imported snails slowly get more expensive, which doesn't suit people who are using them in bulk like the restaurant chains and so on. And there, funnily enough, there's a shortage from time to time as well. More upmarket restaurants are hesitant to put snails on their menu because what comes into the country is not the French snail, and which is where we slot in. Snails aren't for everyone, but in South Africa they're making a comeback, thanks to the country's diverse population. We have a lot of people, uh, the Greeks, Portuguese, the Italians, the Spanish, uh, even the Afrikaans community eats snails, so it's not uh, a product that it goes to one sector, it's a product that covers a multitude of, of ethnic people. Harvesting snail eggs is also a profitable but extremely delicate process. Known as white caviar in Europe, they can fetch more than $200 for just 125 grams. We are the only people that have ever harvested white caviar in South Africa. We showed the chef's council and they said, when can we have? Once again, you know, the white caviar is our future herd. The Mikalev snail business is far from sluggish. All they need is a push from investors to help meet demand and expand the South African market. Julie Shire, CGTN, Johannesburg, South Africa.